It is a real honor to be part of the Mission First project and be able to uh, really reflect on what my alma mater has given me throughout my career, uh, the different values I've taken from the foundation and especially from the athletic fields uh, at West Point. It's a real special project and uh, it's, it's neat to see the different ways and the different achievements that Army athletics and Army athletes have made throughout their careers. I don't think I would be anywhere near I where I am now without the foundation that I developed at West Point. Uh, the military foundation for me was exactly what I needed and where I wanted to be at that time. The values uh, that you learn at West Point that really become inherent to who you are and what you can expect of a graduate, integrity and selfless service, and honor, being trustworthy, being a leader, being a follower, understanding those roles and when to transition between being a leader and a follower or a teammate. West Point was very good at providing me a variety of situations on the sports field, in my cadet companies and in the classroom where I really learned what those words meant, what those values meant, and throughout my career, be it personally and professionally as a commander, as a, as a combat helicopter pilot in Iraq, as a test pilot in the Army, uh, and now as an astronaut, I use the foundations that I developed at West Point on a daily basis, interacting and being part of high achieving teams, and I can't imagine a better place to have gotten that foundation than at West Point. The ties that I keep to West Point are mainly through other graduates and uh, friends that I developed at the time and teammates. When I come across another West Point graduate in any walk of life, there is a, an instant connection, an instant bond, a common foundation. And even if I didn't know them when I was a cadet, uh, it's, it's, uh, it's a familiarity, it's like running into an old family member. Um, those are the connections that I mainly keep. Uh, I definitely keep up with Army athletics and academic achievements and the achievements of the various graduates that have gone uh, before and after me uh, through the news. I think once you've been through an institution like West Point, it's part of who you are. It's not something that you do. It's not some place you went and that you ever leave. Uh, it becomes really part of who you are to the core. Uh, and those values uh, that we talked about, you know, and the ability to be a leader and be part of an institution who develops you to understand what, it's, what it means to be part of something bigger than yourself, uh, to really put other people and a mission before yourself. I think that becomes such a part of who you are that you never really move on from it. It, it, it actually, to me, has become more significant the longer, uh, longer it goes from West Point. And I can see how much the country and our world uh, needs young officers and leaders with the values that were instilled in us at West Point.